Hi, welcome to Black Sheep Blogger. Today I'll be reviewing a Baja beach bag tote, which is ginormous. And I really wanted to do an entire packing up this bag to show you just how much stuff can fit in here because it's amazing. I didn't think it was that big from the pictures and then I got it and opened it up and said, whoa, I'm taking everything to the beach. So uh, I want to start by showing you something called a bath sheet. I have a couple towels actually rolled up ready to go under there. But I just wanted to show you how ginormous this thing actually is. I could use it as a blanket in the house and be completely warm. So I'm actually going to fold this thing in half and then roll it up the same as I showed you the other towels were. Because if you're going to pack anything in any beach bag, it needs to be army rolled and, and that's that. So I'm just going to pause real quick. I'm going to fold this up, roll it up, and then I'm going to show you guys how I pack this bag. Alright, be right back. Hello, welcome back. Okay, so there are my towels all rolled up. This is the bath sheet that I showed you. Um, this would be the bag. As you see, folded up, it doesn't look like it's that much, but you'll see these folds here where it actually extends. This has got to be like eight inches. I'm not really sure. Inside pocket, it's ginormous. Inside as well. So now let me show you this. So now I can take the bath sheet. There is still room left over in here. You can see up at the top. I still have four inches of room one way and eight inches of room the opposite way after putting the sheet in there. So I got that. You can actually take a little tip is taking a fitted sheet, like a regular fitted sheet for your bed and taking that to the beach, which I did not grab one of those, but that would be the, probably the tiniest thing I ended up putting in this bag anyway. But you can take those and then put them upside down, put all your stuff in the corners of each one, and then you kind of have like a sand-free section to sit in. So that's pretty cool. Okay, so here we go. Do this towel. I'm going to take the small towel, and that's going to stand up on the side in all that excess room I had. But I still have room for my fourth towel. These are not teeny tiny towels. The first one is a sheet, and the rest of these are just really big towels, except for the green one that I put sideways. And then I would have my tanning oil. I could shove that down in the side. And I still have more room. It's not that heavy. And these, normally, anytime you get any type of bag that has these, they're kind of rough and, and mm -hmm. scrapey is not the right word. Just, they're very rough. These are the softest I've ever felt in my life. I'll put this on my shoulder without having an issue whatsoever. No chafing, no nothing. It's just going to sit there comfortably like your favorite jerseys, like t-shirts or they just so smooth, so comfortable. The bag isn't that smooth and comfortable, but it's canvas. It's waterproof or at least water resistant. Little pocket inside. It's made by Odyssey Company. Oh, uh -huh, that's so uh, clever actually. I like that little name. It's cute. So this little thing right here. I could put my cell phone. I mean, I have battery chargers. There's so many different things I would put in there that you could fit, but there's certain things that I'll take a cooler, like my electronics. I've melted a cell phone at the beach before, so I don't tend to put any electronic things in here. Um, I'll take a cooler with just one cooling thing on the outside and put all my electronic gadgets in there just to save it from the heat because 110 degrees will melt a cell phone, just so you know. All right, uh, I hope you enjoyed this review and you can see how much stuff is actually going to fit in here. I could put two more towels in here if I really wanted to, but I don't really think I have to for you to understand how amazing this bag is. I cannot wait to go to the beach. Oh, I almost forgot side compartments as well. It has those. You can fit something in there. Once you have a lot of stuff inside, it is a tighter fit in here. So I'd say that's for dropping your cell phone in there real quick while you're walking from the car to the beach or vice versa. Just so you don't have to, you know, shove it back inside something. But I highly recommend this bag for anybody who's setting up the beach all the time. And you're taking four people with you. This is going to fit all your stuff. So have a great day.